I'm also a member of the governor's senior staff. I'm not just anybody who was sent here because I happen to be from Bakersfield. I've been a prosecutor in this county for nearly four decades, and I have seen firsthand how imperative Kern County's oil and gas industry has been in helping to maintain public safety. The folks that you see in the audience behind me, our neighbors, our friends, our relatives, the ones outside, those are all real people, they're real families. This is gonna have a significant impact on their families. Banning anything in Kern County only shifts things to foreign nations, as you've heard. If we don't produce it here, it's going to come from there. This industry saved my life, and uh, the way that happened was uh, implemented in a program through the California Youth Authority, and uh, it got me a job in the industry, which these people were willing to give a second chance. Now, I'm here today, you know, without a college education, make six figures, able to break that chain of cycle and to provide for my family and my son. Through the, through the oil, in the oil industry, it, it, it gave me a turnaround. I'm able to, to be right here in front of you, find people not on a parole trying to be released, just saying thank you guys. Amen. And if we could all work together. Basically, I'm an independent oil producer, so I have to raise capital either through my own pocket, through outside investors, and, uh, and otherwise my projects don't go. I can't move forward, I can't drill wells, I can't build facilities, I can't create jobs. Kern County has to find ways to protect their investment base. But the mama pops wanted me to continue on because they could see the problems and concerns that were on the horizon. But I'm really concerned about the state. Uh, you guys are in charge. We're supposed to be working together. That was the original charge for DOG and industry to work together. So far, over the last two or three years, I haven't seen it. They got new leadership sitting over here. We'll see. You know what happens when you lose a job? Mom and dad have to move out of Taft. They're gone. If you see your neighbors lose their jobs that you've grown up with, that's what's gonna to happen to them. They're moving to Texas.